Hello. So this video is about buying things from AliExpress and Alibaba. You may have heard of these websites. They're budget, uh, cheap Chinese websites for buying everyday goods, everything from uh, consum consumer electronics through to clothes at discount prices. But there are a couple of things to look out for, a couple of things that I was a little bit sceptical about before I made my first purchase on AliExpress. And um, hopefully this video will set a few of those things straight. So I've ordered probably about 20 things from AliExpress over the last year. I bought a steering wheel cover, I bought an Arduino robot set, uh, I've bought a cuddly toy. <laughs> it sounds like the Generation game this does, doesn't it? I've also bought Apple Watches from there, cheap Apple Watches, um, and you can I'll link down below uh, for my review of those cheap Apple Watches, and I bought an LED light bulb, which I was a little bit um, scared about because it had, you have to plug it into the main supply, and I've heard these cheap ones are a little bit, um, you know, if they're badly manufactured or they're not manufactured with safety in mind, they could be very, very dangerous. So that's a risk, um, and ordinarily I, I wouldn't advise buying that that sort of thing. But in general, I've bought a lot of things off of AliExpress and I've been happy with with 90% of them and the prices have been very very competitive even though they've been sent from China. There are a couple of things to look out for. Firstly, not all the prices on there are good value. You have to sort by price and um, you can search for quite some time to find the right keywords. Obviously English may not be the first language for a lot of the people selling on AliExpress, so you have to try a few different keywords to find the items uh, that you want, and maybe look at the recommended listings when you've looked at when you're looking at a current listing to see if there's any cheaper suggestions. Um, and also look around on English websites as well or American websites to make sure that you are actually getting a good price because they are not all good. There are a number of things like the Apple Watch which are copying branded things and indeed the GoPro thing that I'm, I've bought. Um, there are a lot of things like that on there and they say that the or they give the impression that the item is identical and in generally the quality of them will not be as high as the as the official um, goods that you would buy in the UK. But if as long as you know that, as long as you're buying something without the expectation that you're buying a super high quality thing, uh, then you know you really can't go wrong. And there are definitely a number of things on AliExpress that you could go to your local Maplins or PC World and pick up um, exactly the same thing and no worse quality uh, for a, a for a lot more money. So there are definitely a lot of bargains to be had. It looks like when you buy things from AliExpress, they don't incur duty in this country because they don't put the value that you've paid for them on the packages. That's nothing to do with me. Uh, that's just what these Chinese uh, sellers appear to be doing. Um, but it's worth it's worth knowing. I did buy one item on AliExpress that was um, damaged when I received it but I opened a dispute on the sort of claims thing on the AliExpress website and it was rectified by the seller immediately and I got um, I think a full or partial refund which I was um, happy with. Uh, in terms of delivery most items that I've ordered I think the maximum delay I've had is two weeks from hitting buy to receiving it through the letterbox. Um, but I have had items arrive um, in as quickly as one week, which is pretty good. I mean, sometimes you can buy things from the UK and they don't uh, arrive as quickly as that. Uh, they all seem to arrive in trademark packaging. I'm not entirely sure why, but they always come in sort of yellow wrapped packages. Uh, every single item, even though I bought them from different sellers. So I'm not really sure what that's... Um, what that's about. Uh, so really, I've got nothing but praise for AliExpress, as long as you're happy to wait like a week or two weeks for your item to arrive. Uh, if you have any questions about buying from AliExpress or Alibaba, leave them in the comments below 
and um, I'll try and answer them. I'll maybe do a follow-up follow up video or I'll answer your comment directly.